Now let's have some blood, sweat and good old pew pew because we are going to speak about a bullet hell game and I have a pleasure to welcome my next guest Milo, the developer responsible for the game called Her Name Was Fire. Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm fine. Tell me please, why in your opinion bullet hell genre is so popular lately and how do you want to stand out uh, above the competition? Yeah, about bullet hell games, yeah, they have uh, gained a lot of popularity recently, especially I think the, I would say more the subgenre of bullet heaven games, mm -hmm. which is where you are actually like the source of the bullets that are on screen. I'm not really sure exactly why the popularity is, is rising up so much right now, but uh, I believe it's something that um, has always existed a bit. If you look at like the 1980s with all the zombie movies, and I think in those movies you, you can really see like... Um, People really enjoy situations in which you barely escape with your life. And I think uh, bullet hell games yeah. really respond to that human feeling that we have. Um, Her Name Was Fire um, shares some similarities with uh, some of the heavy hitters in the genre right now, like uh, Vampire Survivors, for example. But I would say that we are making the game a bit more hardcore in terms of controls and gameplay and um, we've received feedback that it's uh, a bit more difficult than those games and that's actually something that we are aiming for we really enjoy that feeling of as i said before of barely escaping with your life mm -hmm. and i think that's one of the main differentiators and the other one is also the we pay a lot of attention to the atmosphere and the mood of the game so for example we use a lot of um, contrasting colors in the game. Like you have this very bright red and bright blue and also the dark synth music that accompanies the whole gameplay, I think ties in a whole, well, yeah, a whole mood that really makes the game shine. Her Name Was Fire is a tarot themed action roguelike that, that I've been developing for the last two months. The game is quite hard, but it's really fun to play. We we see people that that are enjoying it a lot. The whole roguelite aspect of the game is is embedded inside the cards that you unlock after reaching every level, and we feel that every card really feels really heavy and really impacts gameplay. So yeah, try it out. It's really fun, and we hope you you enjoy it. Mm -hmm.